So I've been out in Pittsfield since I'd say probably about 2013. I'd uh, started at GD and I left there in 2014 and I joined uh, Lightning Technologies, which was awesome. I, I, I couldn't have found a better fit for the things I was interested in. Uh, I got to be a mad scientist and play with some really dangerous and expensive equipment there. So that, that was kind of cool. And you know, then I had the opportunity to join EMA. Uh, so EMA has been a force in the electromagnetics industry for a long time. Uh, it was founded back in the late 1970s by Rod Perala. We make a commercial product called EMA 3D. Um, it's people all over the world use it. It's really powerful. Uh, what we use that for is to solve problems like lightning effects on aircraft and wire harnesses, um, various niche research projects and areas like that. But the majority of our business is consulting. You know, we've been working on SpaceX, Blue Origin projects, uh, projects for the military, all branches. What we're, we're doing out here in the, in the Berkshires is the first major test foray for the company. You know, space is the new frontier, right? It's it's where everybody's going, what everybody's doing. It's, you can't read a newspaper without seeing something about a rocket ship or something going into space. And, and so we started looking at it, like, how can we get our piece of this? So we're going to be building a chamber here in the Berkshire Innovation Center that can replicate all the various types of environments that satellites and, and components that are going to go into space. And this includes uh, materials for spacesuits. This is uh, circuit boards, uh, novel materials, things that we haven't even dreamt up yet. Um, we're going to be able to characterize them and state really what they're going to do when they go into space before they go. We have a lot to offer, I think, locally here. Uh, there's a lot of companies that are looking to come into the area. Uh, that are also participants in the aerospace and space sectors here. So just right off the bat, the ability to have a vacuum chamber locally that can simulate temperatures is very valuable for the plastics industry. Uh, vacuum testing is already a huge part of what that industry does. So uh, we're going to have that locally here, and, and uh, we've had discussions with a lot of folks about you know participating and using the chamber there um, but you know you have a big company like General Dynamics which participates in all sorts of stuff I mean we've worked with different branches of GD all over the country uh, and so you know we, we hope to that'll be a very valuable partnership here but the big I think benefit locally is going to be bringing in people that are not local into the community out here and that's because space is not something that you find in New England it's all on the space coast down in Florida or in California where SpaceX is and uh, I'm not here to say that you know space is going to be what Pittsfield's known for but it's certainly a start.